Hey there, Tori, and welcome to Friday. You know what? I think it's going to be a damn good weekend for the Tauruses. That's because the moon will be putting emotional focus on your projects this weekend. It's moving into Gemini, and that's the way Tauruses manage what they like cast. They really tend to like cast in duality. That's a whole other topic. But I do want to say you have emotional vibration ready and charged to put behind whatever it is you are out there producing. Tauruses are natural producers and gifted at light casting and making things happen. They make natural parents, they make natural farmers, natural producers in Hollywood. They really just kind of are great at putting things together all the way down to Legos as children. One thing I do want to note though, Mars has been retrograde in this sector of consciousness for some time now. Now Mars retrograde, kind of a scary thing because Mars is the big pusher. It pushes, it's energy that pushes. And if you know Arieses and how they can sometimes be pushy, that's the Martian energy. That's the way Mars is. It's what helps us get off the couch and actually get it done. And that's what Aries are really brilliant at. But when it's moving backwards, it's usually not looking in the rear view mirror, I find Mars. Because if Mars is retrograding a sector of someone's consciousness, it often is a part of consciousness that they raced by before. And so the universe is taking you back so you can see something. This weekend, on Saturday in particular, the moon will cross into this retrograde Mars which is an opportunity to react, to redo, or to have to do an emotional replay of some drama or issue or lesson you have around anything you're light casting, which can be children, crops, films, everything, you know, the whole list. So Saturday, good chance of drama, but pay close attention to whatever it is. And on Sunday, the sun moves zero degrees Aquarius. I always say zero means zero, and it's true. When the sun is at zero degrees, it's kind of halfway between both signs, and I often find the whole earth just feels a little off. I don't want anyone to really compound the uh, Mars conjunction of the moon on Saturday night with Sunday. Sunday's going to feel weird regardless, I think. All right, Tori, that's all I got for the weekend forecast. See you back on Monday. Live, love, be. So good.